The first part of the 2016-17 PGA Tour season concludes at the RSM Classic. After a six-week break, events resume in January on the islands of Hawaii. Going to Hawaii anytime is great, and when I can go there with my family to actually work, it's tremendous. It's a great way to kickstart the year. Of the 40 events remaining, three are World Golf Championships, including the WGC Mexico Championship in Mexico City and the WGC Dell Technologies Match Play in Austin, Texas, where Jason Day will seek a third career title. My whole mentality that week was to be able to frustrate people with my short game. I mean, I felt like I did a pretty good job at it, and you know, be able to get the win was special. The players returns to its traditional Mother's Day finish, and the season concludes in September with the 11th edition of the FedEx Cup playoffs, where Rory McIlroy can become the first back-to-back -back FedEx Cup champion. Roars around Eastlake for Rory McIlroy. A week later, the President's Cup will be at Liberty National Golf Club where Nick Price and the international team will take on Steve Stricker and Team USA. There is no shortage of intriguing storylines, including the pending return of Tiger Woods. Everyone's so excited. It'd be nice to experience a tournament where Tiger brings that added atmosphere and buzz. We're certainly in for an exciting 2017 on the PGA Tour. I'm looking forward to next year. I feel like the game's, you know, in really good shape. I'm looking for another big season.